The following is your sixth grade lesson for the 8th and 9th of March. So, Mr. Foisy is wrapping up his Paul Revere's ride lesson today. So, learning goals, students will be able to explain how the author develops the point of view using details from the text. Remember, you have a spelling test on Friday. Your reading log number 9 is due March 16th. There is no late work for that one, okay? Your AR test is due at the end of the month. Your next planner app and PRT book check will be next Tuesday. And make sure you are buying paper, okay? I was kind of not joking around anymore. I will actually start charging people for paper if they need it starting next week, okay? Complete the bell work. Please complete the bell work. Which is, what was the bell work? Bell work was post a note, right? Put two things you have learned from this lesson when done. Put on the post note on the whiteboard. We're going to complete something called a TP cast today. It's an analysis of a poem, okay? I'm going to take a quiz as well. And there's an end of the unit video, which we did not get to in class. All right, so 283 is your poem. Paul Revere's, excuse me, not 283, 285. I'm going to change that. 285. You know what? I'm doing it right now. I'm going to change that to 285. There we go. So, page 285 is Paul Revere's ride. You're going to answer all of these questions here. Okay, it's going to take you a little while because this was block day's work. So, make sure you're pausing the screen so that way you're able to tell what's going on. All right, and your quiz. If you are absent, it is currently on E campus. Okay, it's just Paul Revere's ride quiz. So take that, and then Mr. Foy's gonna make sure he gets those grades updated for you shortly. Okay. Now we weren't able to get to it in class, but if you would like, go ahead and walk, click, uh, type in that YouTube address into your video, uh, like into your computer, your web browser. And that'll show you kind of a fun little way of wrapping everything up, which we didn't quite get to today in class. Okay? Other than that, that concludes the lesson of the day.